to this special multiplayer DVD version of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Your chance to try your luck in that famous hot seat and compete against your family or friends to be the first to reach the magical million pound mark and the chance, of course, to win a family holiday to Universal Mediterranean. Now, all you need is your DVD remote control. You can move around the screen and make your choices by using the up, down, left, right and enter buttons. It really couldn't be simpler. Right, if you're ready, let's play. Right, here we go. Let's go over the rules, although I'm sure you're familiar with them all by now. You are 15 correct answers away from winning a virtual million pounds. Now, as always, you can walk away at any time. And if you do get stuck, then you have the usual three lifelines. There's 50-50. You can phone a friend, or of course you can ask the audience. OK, if you're ready, all you need to do now is select the number of players, and we can play Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? So, you fancy another go at winning the million? OK, best of luck. Let's play. OK, for 100 quid, here's question number one. Nice one. It's the correct answer. Have a look at question number two. It's worth 200 quid. You're absolutely correct. Well played. Here's question number three. It's worth £300. That's great. It's the right answer. Remember, a wrong answer here and you will leave with nothing. I'm sure that won't happen. Question number four. Absolutely correct. Well played. Now, get the next question correct and you'll leave with at least a thousand pounds. Good luck. Here comes question number five. Why not have a drink while you mull this one over? Okay, you've decided to use your 50-50. Computer, please take away two random wrong answers, leave the correct answer, and the one remaining wrong answer. Absolutely spot on. Well done. You've reached the first milestone. That's £1,000. Now, have a look at question six, because it could double your money to 2000 Which golfer is nicknamed Wild Thing? Ernie Els, Ken Brown, John Daly, or Jack Nicklaus? So, you decided to ask the audience. Well, now let's hope that they can help. Audience, on your keypads, please. All vote now.
Excellent. Right answer. Here comes question number seven out of a possible 15. It's worth £4,000. Good luck. Who was famously revealed as believing Rio de Janeiro was a person and Portugal was in Spain? Jennifer Lopez, Jane Leaves, Jade Goody or Jordan? Right, you've decided to phone a friend, but who do you think will know the answer to this one? You're in luck. The answer is C. Yeah, definitely, definitely C. Go for it. That's absolutely correct. Well played. Okay, if you choose the right answer to the next question, you can double your money to £8,000. Let's have a look at question 8 of 15. What is the capital city of Malta? Charnia, Nicosia, Kerkira, or Valletta? Congratulations, that's the right answer. Right, the jumps are starting to get a lot bigger now. Here is question nine for a possible 16,000 pounds. The football club Feyenoord is based in which Dutch city? Amsterdam. Eindhoven, Groningen, Rotterdam. Make sure you don't press the wrong button. Wonderful, it's the right answer. Okay, this is where the drops start to get steeper. Get the next question wrong and you lose 15,000 pounds. But get it right and you win 32,000 guaranteed. A basic physics equation, pressure equals force divided by what? Speed, area, mass or volume? That's absolutely correct. Well played. Right, question number 11 is worth £64,000. You would still walk away with 32000 even if you got it wrong. But let's hope you don't. The line, go ahead, make my day, was made famous by which fictional US detective? Frank Drebin, Harry Callahan, Jim Rockford, or Jimmy Doyle? the right answer. It's going really well so far. Right, the next question is worth a whopping £125,000. It's number 12 of a possible 15. Take your time, it's a lot of money. In 2003, which Formula One racing driver was dropped by the BAR team for the 2004 season? Jacques Villeneuve, Jensen Button, Olivier Parnis, or Ryo Fukuda? Absolutely spot on. Well done. Right, now just take your time and relax. The next question is number 13 of a possible 15. If you answer and you're wrong, you drop back to 32,000 pounds. Here's the question for a quarter of a million. With which field of the arts is the critic Brian Sewell associated? Theater, art, dance, or opera?
Well played. You're absolutely right. This is now getting very, very serious. You are just two correct answers away from winning one million pounds. But if you give me a wrong answer here, you will lose 218,000 pounds. Not good. Have a look at question number 14, but think very carefully about what you want to do. The Swede Major Ernst Killander is credited with inventing which sport? Triathlon, orienteering, korfball, or ice speedway? That's absolutely correct. Well played. Fantastic, you have played a brilliant game so far and now you have 500,000 pounds. But we would really like to give you one million. Take as long as you need. Here comes the million pound question. What typically British item was given to Brad Pitt in June 2003? Bowler hat, blue Peter badge, cricket ball, or Rolls-Royce car? Well, you could have walked away with half a million pounds. But instead, you'll be walking away with one million pounds. That's the right answer. Fantastic. What a tremendous game. All 15 questions answered correctly. Well done. You are a virtual millionaire. Congratulations. Now, for a chance of jetting off for a fabulous holiday to Universal Mediterranean, all you have to do is write this special win code on the postcard provided and send it to us in the post. It couldn't be easier. Good. Well done and thank you for playing. Who wants to be a millionaire?